Hello friends, welcome to my new video. In today's lesson, I will teach you on how to allow specific IP address to remote to our marketing. Okay, so this one to it is a part of strengthen our uh, security in our marketing. Okay, so uh, to allow the specific IP to remote to our, our marketing, first you need to go to system, and then you go to user. Okay, let's say I have a uh, IT user, okay, this IT. So let's say if you don't set here, he can remote, okay. For example, I close, I close, I close, and then I go to my tech, okay. And here is IP address, I put IT and its password, connect, okay. So it can be accessed now, okay. What is I? allow this user with the specific IP I go to user okay so this one I allow another ID for example I allow this ID only uh, for example okay I allow only this ID let's say what is the username what is the password uh, the IP address of the user Want to see okay the IP address of the user is this one 253 okay now I allow only uh, 254 okay what happened I close and then I go to winbox again IT okay connect you see error wrong username and password I try again error wrong username and password so your username cannot be accessed okay Okay, oh, I will change to admin because I have one restrict on admin. Okay, so I can access. So is what if I put this user back? Okay, to Y three. Okay, and you can also add more user. You can also add IP rank here. Okay, but not recommend for here. For example, if I have I want to add another IP address. Okay, you can add here. For example, 222, okay, so you can add this one. You can also add more, okay. okay this one I back apply, okay. Now I drop it, let's say I go again, okay. I go to IT and password, I put this one. okay. Now it can be accessed. Okay, uh, so that's all for today's lesson. I hope that you find this lesson useful. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.